morning, Cardos, and welcome back to the morning news. Today is Octo Friday, October 4th, 2019. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Our Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you, you may now be seated. Hey Kim, what's the lunch? I mean the weather. For today's weather, we have a, the current temperature of 71 and a high of 98 and a low of 68. It's sunny, it sure doesn't feel like fall. For today's lunch, we have small chef salad, pepperoni pizza, french fries with chocolate chip cookies. Ooh, that sounds so good. Kim, do we have birthdays? For We don't have any birthdays for today, but we have birthdays on the weekend. For Saturday's birthdays, we have Stalasia Shannon, and for Sunday's birthdays, we have Serenity Glover and Trayshawn Keith. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Make sure you have a good birthday over the weekend. Okay, for today's announcements, we have... Hold on, Kim, wait. Today is National Taco Day. Do you like tacos? Yes, I do, Soraya. Speaking of tacos, what's our Hispanic Heritage Month question today? Our Hispanic Heritage Month trivia is, how large is the self-defining Hispanic population at present? Make sure to turn in your answers to the media center. Hey, Sarai, what's today's quote? Well, today's quote is, success is a lousy teacher. It seduces smart people into thinking they can't lose. We have other announcements, Kim. Tomorrow is World Teachers, World Teachers Day. Make sure to hug your teachers and tell them they've been doing a great job teaching you. See those words pride depicting and creation around the school? Make sure to use those words when you're writing next week. Here's the video about these words. Hello, Cardinals. Guess what's happening next week? Jacqueline, do you know? Yep, I sure do. It's our writing initiative. Kimberly, can you tell us one of our words? One of our words is creation, which is the action or process of bringing something into existence. Some other words are establishment, formation, formulation, and production. I will use those. Well, can you tell us one? Depicting, to show or represent by a drawing, painting, or other art form to, to portray and words describe. Here are some synonyms for it. Characterize, detail, illustrate, imper, in, interpret, paint, portrays, repre, represent, and reprocess. Jack, Jacqueline, do you know the third word? Yep, I sure do. It is pride, a feeling or deep pleasure or satisfaction driven by one's own actions. The achievements of those whom one is closely associated are from qualities or possessions that are widely admired. Confidence and self-respect as expressed by, me by members of groups, typically one that has been socially marginalized and based on their shared identity, culture, and experience. Some synonyms for pride will be ego, pridefulness, self-esteem, self-regard, and self-respect. Wow, that's a lot of words. Yeah. Teachers, please discuss these words to prepare for the writing. Creation. Depicting. And pride. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you, students, for that wonderful video. Now stay tuned for the Friday song from Ms. Waymire's class. Have a great weekend. Bye. It's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so glad it's not Monday. It's not Tuesday. It's not Wednesday. It's not Thursday. But it's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's F-R-I. Who we? D-A-Y. Say what is F-R-I. Who we? D-A-Y. Say what is Friday. This feeling inside my bones It goes electric wavy when I turn it on All through my city, all through my home 
We're flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got 